there is one baby picture of Shima where she got a little attitude, arms crossed, looking away. I was like, that's Shima. <laughs> Who's this? That's my daddy. He's yeah. big. How old's your daddy? He looks super young. He's gonna be 58. Is that your brother? Yeah, that's my brother. Oh, oh my God. God. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's grandma. grandma and mommy. Our family's very, very small, but very strong women. I'm so excited. Okay, let's see what the letter says. Oh, this is mom. Okay. Um, my mom's sick, so I didn't know if she'd have the energy or the, you know, wherewithal to do it. So, but she said, my new doctors have a new diagnosis for which brings me new hope. I don't want to bother you with details. Things do seem to be getting better. Everyone is taking good care of me, so don't worry about me. I knew my mother was sick coming into the game and getting a letter from her was very encouraging, letting me know that she's doing better. If you receive this letter, you must have become HOH. Congrats. We are all rooting for you. We are very proud of you. Remember to follow your dreams and your heart, but be realistic. Concentrate on your game and remember, Big Brother is watching. <laughs> Love, Mom. <laughs> Hearing from my mother definitely gave me inspiration in this game. It was just really nice to hear her encouraging words and have the letter to refer to in times of weakness when I'm in this game. Cute. Congrats on being the first girl. I know. I know. Thank you. <laughs> it was nice to see a woman as head of household. I know Shima and I have had our differences, and I'm not sure where I stand with her, but I'm hoping that she just likes other people in the house more than me, and maybe Russell is her target this week. I don't know what to do, Michelle. And I know everyone's like, Shima said she's gonna send Russell home. So, so I mean, you have to do what's best for you, and things change, like. The whole, so. yeah, and then Natalie and Jesse, you know they're in my ear. Yeah. But I have to make a decision that benefits me in the game. Mm -hmm. And they still kind of want Russell to stay, and I don't necessarily know if I want to do that. You know? Mm -hmm. I said this once or twice, mm -hmm. maybe three times, that I want a woman to win. And that's why I feel like right now, with my thoughts, I was going to put women up. But then I'm, re I'm like, I don't want to put women up. <laughs> why not put one of the strongest, fiercest competitors in this game who wronged me out of the house? Quite a few people have been burned by Russell, but my alliance thinks I should keep Russell for the strength in numbers. It's a lot to think about. The power itself is a big responsibility. I mean, you have to make the choice that's best for you and will prolong you in the game, you know. Why are you here? I'm just trying to let you know. I feel like everyone in life makes a mistake. I'm not saying it's acceptable, but I'm saying I'm sorry. This is very important. You know, I need to mend my relationship with Shima, or I could go home this week. You do know that. I said if I win HOH, I'm sending Russell home. You do know that. I'm, I'm sure you did. I was in your same shoes, same time last week. I didn't put anyone up, because I said from the beginning, I was like, this I'm is my team. I'm based on personal reasons. As far as strategically, I'd hope you don't think that I'm coming after you, because what happened was a personal issue and it got spiraled out of control. From what happened, um, on my end, I'm sorry. Everyone loses their cool, and I lost my cool, and I shouldn't have said those things. So uh, what more can I say? I don't know, but it's like, are my actions genuine? Yeah, I'm sure you can tell. I'm having a hard time trusting you, even with the apology. I'm not gonna blatantly lie to someone. I'm not. I mean, I'm not gonna lie to somebody and be like, Russell, stab him in the back. Russell, you have blatantly lied. Michelle was saying, if Well, then that, that's, back... that's where you need to sit down and be like, am I gonna trust someone who's repeatedly lied, or am I gonna trust him because he's actually on the same team? Now, she made me look like a liar, and I didn't lie. I, I'm just telling you for what it's worth. I know you're strong, and I admire you for it. Come here. I have my personal issues with Russell. I don't trust him on a personal level. I have to decide whether that's enough reason to put him up, um, because strategically, it may benefit both me and my alliance to keep him aligned with us. Ew, I hate spiders. That thing's huge. I know. It's all the way over there, you can see it. <laughs> It's making a web, I think, huh? 
You think? Yeah. Like all in that corner. So if a bird flies in there, that big ass spider's gonna eat it. What do they make their webs out of? Web? Yeah, but where does it come from? Does it shoot out of their butt? I don't know where it comes out of. <laughs> their wrists. Nuh uh. Yeah, like Spider Man. They make it so symmetrical, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, I know. I don't know how they do it. I wouldn't know how to do it if I was a spider. I think if you were a spider, you would know how to do it. No, I'm saying it would be hard to learn. How do spiders mate? The same way you do. Duh, I know, but how do they do it? You know, like horses do it from behind. Dude, what, are, what is your mind? What do you think about all day? <laughs>